Recently, a newly diagnosed family wrote to me and said, We are at the start of our journey, and stories like yours fill me with hope and strength for the journey ahead. There's heartbreak, of course, but there's more hope. As a parent, hope is something I didn't know I would need so much of, that it would keep me going on the harder days. As we ride up in the gondola for Ella's first ski lesson with Rocky Mountain Adaptive, I am hopeful. I rode this gondola to work for years, and now I'm riding it with my daughter. But Ella's first lesson didn't go as planned. We didn't even get her ski boots on. That was hard. Back to basics. Practice, practice, practice. Boots on in the living room. New social story on her speech device. More visuals for the words she doesn't have. Ella has Rett syndrome, a rare disease. There's heartbreak, of course, but there's more hope. The next weekend, I am hopeful and we're successful. The boots are on. It seems so much easier this time. All that practice paid off. Not giving up is hard work, but it sure is worth it. Another weekend at the hill and I am standing with tears of pride streaming down my face. When Ella was diagnosed three years ago, we were worried she would be in a wheelchair by now. And here she is, going up a chairlift. This makes me believe anything is possible. Ella skied down a run and immediately signed for more. I love watching her comfort with the instructors. I love that they know how to push her a little more each time. I look over to the building where my husband and I celebrated our wedding 11 years before and never could have imagined where we would be today that we would be watching our little girl defying the odds. My hope is one day she will ski with her older brother. After that lesson, Ella talked to friends about skiing. She smiled and giggled when they said things like, Ella, I saw a video of you skiing. You did awesome. She used her speech device to say, Chalot up, Connor. Her brother beamed with pride and said, Ella, we'll ski together soon. Being a parent and a continual caregiver is exhausting. All the appointments and paperwork can feel like a job. And then something like this happens. We are on our journey and that family was right. There is heartbreak, but there's always hope. And I am filled with gratitude for all the people that see Ella the way I do.